Right. One thing we love is that they take all your luggage, they take all your groceries, and they deliver it right to your room. They just give you a little ticket so you can walk freely. And this was our second visit to Vedanta at the Riviera Maya location. If you want to see the first one, you can check out the link now. This one will just have a lot more tips and suggestions, stuff we didn't cover in the first one. So sit back and enjoy. First, let's start with the rooms. Did I mention I made a quick video of just the rooms at the Grand Mayan Riviera Maya location? Check it out here with the link. Hello everybody, this is Mac and Hannah coming to you from Vedanta Riviera Maya. We are back, we love it, we're doing it again this summer. So we're gonna cover some things that we didn't do last time, uh, give you guys a little more experience, what it's like coming down here. Hannah, what are you doing, what are you been doing this week? I was just gonna add that we'll answer some of your questions, like is there laundry? And that is a heck yes. yes. And right now we're going back to our favorite place. We are headed to Saloom. They have craft beer made in house, which is incredible. Mm. IPAs, we're doing it. So you know stay us. tuned <laughs> and we'll show you more Vedanta. We are at our favorite place. They have four IPAs on tap here at Wama. The New England is off the track. <laughs> And Saloom wins again! Great DJ too. And live music. And it turned out that Mercado Mexicano had multiple nights with live music. Great vibes, really fun, highly recommend going down there when you visit. So after a long day of travel and a great start to the vacation, we headed back to our room peacefully along the boardwalks because we had to get ready for our meeting the next morning. And with every meeting, you get a free breakfast buffet. And they took us to Quinto, which overlooks the ocean and was delicious with tons of options and great service and you may be thinking what i have to go to a meeting on vacation it's totally voluntary they'll ask you at the front desk basically if you're not a member they encourage you to join their membership and if you are a member they tell you about all the updates and new features of each membership so totally up to you we love doing them and highly recommend and welcome back to the beach at vidanta riviera maya just wanted to share a couple tips with you. One, fill up your cooler at Jade Boutique. The seltzers and beer are 45 pesos or so. And then much cheaper. I mentioned to you before that this isn't really a beach resort. Um, obviously they have the beach. Amazing. But what I was mentioning is that there's so much coral and rocks in the ocean that it's kind of hard to go swimming in it. You gotta walk out gingerly, take care of your toes. And what we were pleasantly surprised to see is they had opened up a few piers. Our last visit, they were all closed. Now there were three options to walk out and this was the view looking back on land. Uh, there is quite a bit of walking and waiting for trolleys uh, because it's so well laid out, you kind of get your own privacy. Um, but it takes a little bit longer to get to the places, so be prepared for that when you get here. I mean, but look what you get to come to. And we were getting a little hungry, so we went back to Saloom. I know it says it opens at 5.30 on the app, but we got there around 1 and they served us. So enjoy Saloom all day long, and this is the view of the beach club right next door. And here we are in Tramonto, the Italian restaurant. 
American Steakhouse. It is closed today. Give you a little vibe of what you get here. So on the second floor of the Jade Boutique giant building is the wine bar and they have basically daily happy hour from 5 30 6 30 two for one not a lot of people are here though using it we are using it so the wine bar is giving us access to these couches we gotta have reservations for the tables and afternoon showers mean amazing sunsets especially on the beach with a live mariachi band down at Saloon, we had to go back again. It is the fanciest beachy food court I've ever been to and can't, can't stop, won't stop. The thing I love about visiting Medanta is you go to a presentation, they kind of update you on new things going on, and then there's all these deals all over the resort. Like you can get discounts at delis and Right now, I bought a pastry and I get a free coffee here at the Jade Deli. And at three o'clock, we headed over to Jungala, the on-site water park, just hopping on a trolley, had ourselves a blast. If you wanna learn more about that, there is a special video. You can click the link now. Otherwise, let's get back to Vidanta. And back at Vedanta, I gotta give a shout out to the Joy Squad. They were super fun, leading music in the pool, leading morning stretching on the beach, tons of activities, ping pong tables, poker tournaments. Seriously, fun for the whole family all day long. They lay out this amazing jogging route, which I also made a video about. You can check out the link here. It takes you all over the resort. You get to see some other hotels involved with Vedanta. You get to see the golf course. Really great time if you're looking for some exercise. And we didn't make it back to Cirque du Soleil, but I do want to leave you guys with this amazing spot we found on our last night in Saloom for a wonderful send-off evening. We know what we love. We found the cheat code. <laughs>